My name is Elizabeth Blancas. I'm uh, 21 years old. I identify as Chicana. Um, both my parents come from Michoacan, Mexico. The work that I do is very much inspired by uh, silk sc screen printing. Um, so artists like uh, Melanie Cervantes, Jesus Barraza of Dignidad Rebelde, um, their work is highly influential for me, you know, as well as my mentor Jessica Sabagal and so many other uh, beautiful artists in our community. The process with this mural, um, I knew that I wanted to do something uh, centering women and specifically indigenous women um, and something that really uh, felt close to me and that I thought was important to connect and have in a public space was um, highlighting women that were on the front lines of fighting against the pipeline in, at Standing Rock. Caro Gonzalez, who's in the top right of the mural, and Lauren Howland, who's in the bottom section of the mural. I'm so thankful that I was able to get a hold of them because there was no way I was going to do it without their consent. And they're just two of the women, of many women who were on the front lines in different ways fighting against the pipeline. You know, there was women who were putting their bodies on the line, women who were cooking for everyone. I mean, I feel like in every aspect, um, women are, you know, the thread that holds us together. Um, and they are the ones that are always doing all this work and labor and including, you know, queer and two-spirit people. There's nothing like being in a space where everyone just wants to see you grow and is supporting you through it in any way they can and is just so happy and honored to witness what you're doing. Um, so I feel very honored to be here. It's such a different experience to see my own work on this scale so publicly. Um, I, I don't think I believed in myself as much as I thought I did until the women in my life pushed me. And when Camille, the main organizer of Unseated Voices, told me I would be here doing my own mural, uh, I did not think that then, but I think she slowly, she planted that seed and we made it happen. And for that, I am grateful. And I think it's also really beautiful because this is such a huge deal for me. And it's also very, it's very much so just the beginning for me since this is my first mural. So it's, it's interesting to see or, you know, to think like where can, where I can go next. And with the women around me, it feels like I can do anything. <laughs> women and two spirits are the backbone of every tribe. I don't think I thought this would happen. Your lifetime, or I mean, time? like in my lifetime, but I didn't think like right now. Like, I don't think I had thought this big. Oh, yeah, until you guys like pushed me.